welcome to india elu tutorials in our last class we have discussed about probability concept various formulas used in it and some examples moving further we will now discuss some typical examples let's do it a coin is tossed three times where e is equal to head on the third toss and f is equal to head on the first two tosses and we need to find out the probability of event e by event f this is a example of conditional probability and this means that what is the probability of happening event e when event f has already taken place in our last class we have learned that formula of finding conditional probability is probability of e intersection f divided by probability of event f let as there is only a single coin and we know that there are only two outcomes of a coin either head or tail and it is tossed three times so total number of outcomes would be equal to 2 to the power 3 which is equal to 8 so possible outcomes of this is 3 times head 3 times tail 2 times head 1 time tail 2 times tail 1 time head 1 time head 2 times tail 1 time tail 2 times head tail head tail and head tail head these are the possible outcomes and we need to find out the probability of e by f so first we will find out what is what are the outcomes of f and what are the outcomes of e so total outcomes of e would be head on the third toss so head on the third toss is equal to h h h then t t h then t h h and h t h number of outcomes of event f is equal to head on first two tosses which is equal to head 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 and then head head tail we don't have any other outcome and the outcomes of e intersection f would be equal to in the, we learned in our last class that when it comes to the intersection we find out the common two outcomes on, in the two events so the only common event in this is head head and head so putting finding the probabilities of these events we need the probability of event f and the probability of e intersection f probability of f would be equal to 2 by 8 because favorable outcomes are 2 and total number of outcomes are 8 so it is equal to 1 by 4 probability of e intersection f is equal to 1 by 8 because favorable outcome is 1 over here and total outcomes are 8 so it is 1 by 8 putting these values in our formula we will get to know probability of e by f which is equal to probability of e intersection f divided by probability of f which would be equal to 1 by 8 divided by 1 by 4 which will be equal to 4 by 8 equal to 1 by 2 so this is the answer of this question let's move to another example let's solve another example a question bank consists of easy 300 true false questions difficult 200 true false questions 500 easy multiple choice questions and 400 difficult multiple choice questions if a question is selected at random what is the probability of getting easy question given that it is a multiple choice questions as it is mentioned in our question given there this is the sign that this question is a conditional probability question to simplify this let's convert this data into tabular form putting the data in the table we 
let's do here true false multiple choice questions easy difficult and here would be the total of the questions and here also would be the total so easy 300 true false questions so true false and easy questions would fall here then difficult 200 true false difficult and true false so put over here 500 easy mcq so easy mcq 500 and then 400 difficult mcq difficult mcqs would be 400 so total would be 300 and 500 800 200 and 400 would equal to 600 and then adding them vertically which gives 300 and 200 equals to 500 500 and 400 is 900 and adding them vertically as well as horizontally that is 500 and 900 is 1400 and 800 and 600 is also 1400 please check that this sum should be equal to your vertical sum as well as your horizontal sum if you are not getting the same sum this means that some mistake is there and you need to check your calculation as this is a conditional probability question and the formula to find conditional probability is equal to probability of a by b is equal to probability of a intersection b divided by probability of b here probability of b is a multiple choice question and a intersection b is probability of getting easy question as well as multiple choice question so let's find out the probability of b which is equal to multiple choice question so total multiple choice questions are here 900 which would be equal to favorable outcomes 900 upon total number of events which is equal to total number of questions which is 400 1400 which gives us 9 by 14 and the probability of a intersection b which is equal to questions which are easy as well as which are multiple choice questions so easy and multiple choice questions are 500 over here so probability would be favorable outcomes upon total number which is 1400 which we get 5 by 14 putting these values in this formula that is probability of a intersection b divided by probability of b gives us 5 by 14 divided by 9 by 14 cancel 14 and we get 5 by 9 as the answer for more tutorials you can visit to indiaedu.com